Hi guys. As I promised when I did my video about raising funds for Operation Barbecue Relief, I am continuing to do that. Um, this is my fundraiser for Operation Barbecue Relief. A uh, percentage of all my sales for September and probably for October are going to go towards that charity. Um, I am going to do this journal. It's like my happy book. Um, and I'm going to do this as a silent auction kind of um, thing. You can either PM me on Facebook your bid or uh, send me an email. And my email link is always down in the description box. So um, let me know when you send me the bid. Um, if you want to be apprised of uh, the high bid, you know, if you want me to keep you up to date as to the high bid, I'll be glad to do that. Um, I'm going to give you just a little walkthrough of the journal right now. It has an elastic tie so that as it grows, it um, can, this can uh, stretch. It is a sewn binding has two signatures in it. The outside cover has been um, sealed and decorated by me, of course. These are mostly jelly prints. Uh, this is a file folder journal that I made, so it, you know, let me see about getting you just a little closer. Not that way, not that way. There we go. Um, All of the pages in here are jelly printed. They are actually jelly printed envelopes. So there is uh, odd side shapes. There's a pocket right here. And these are all hand painted jelly prints by me. Um, all different colors it is it is like I said junk mail envelopes that I have layered together each page is about one envelope uh, this might be one envelope makes two pages I'm not sure um, I'm actually not sure how many pages are in a signature I'll I'll count in just a minute I just really wanted you to see all of the different jelly plates. It's still got the windows in it, partially because I like the sound. So what you will need to do is email me or private message me on Facebook with your bid. I'm going to Take bids until September 30th at 5 p.m. Central Time. At that time, whoever is the high bid will win the journal. So September 30th, 5 p.m. Remember that you must have your bid in by then. Um, it's going to be silent bidding, but I will be glad to let you know if someone else takes the high bid from you. There will be shipping on this journal. I, I'm not going to pay for the shipping. Um, well, I shouldn't say that. If it goes over what I'm hoping for, I might pay for shipping. We'll see. But I better say, whatever your bid is plus shipping, that would be the best choice. To do. I love this print. I like the shapes in the envelopes. I like the, how the pages come out. As you can see, the pages are not all the same size. And that's the first signature. Now I'll tell you how many pages are in there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
so that'd be 16, which means there's actually 32 pages. There's 16 sheets, 32 pages. Okay, so this is the second signature. Remember, a portion of your bid will be going to Operation Barbecue Relief. They're a charity that I'm trying to support this next couple of months. I love that. That's bubble wrap on the jelly plate. There's quite a few of my um, raked papers, which kind of look like paste paper. That one is similar to what's on the cover. Now if the front signature had 32 pages and this one had, should have 32 pages, that's a total of 64 pages, right? I think. This would be great to doodle in. It would be great to um, write in. It would be great to art in and use this as a background. There's, I use mine to keep my happy mail in, but you could use it for whatever purpose you would like. There is, of course, a pocket back here, and that's the back cover. This is the front cover again. This is the back cover. And again, it's got a closure right here. And I didn't cut the tie off because should it grow so much that this is too tight, which I don't think it would, you could um, extend it. You could also put some beads or something on here if you wanted to. Um, it's sort of a, a blank journal, even though it's a blank journal with all jelly plated pages. So I hope you all are interested. Um, if you're not, I hope you just skip the video. But uh, thanks for watching, and uh, I'm going to read you a quote from our 1001 Ways of Creativity and get on with my chores. I've got chores I've got to get done today. There are only two ways of telling the complete truth. Anonymously and posthumously. Thomas Sowell. I don't believe that is true. I don't like that quote. I think I will read you a different one. Drama, instead of telling us the whole of a man's life, must place him in such a situation, tie such a knot, that when it is untied, the whole man is visible. Leo Tolstoy. Hmm. Boy, oh boy. I'm not sure. Okay, guys. Go have fun. Make some art. Bye-bye.